I'm so glad you're here. This is not the way that I thought tonight would end up. <laughs> you having regrets already? No. It was nice. Nice? Oh, yeah, it was, it was hot and it was sexy and it was the best that I've ever had. Mm. <laughs> Nothing like a break to get the spark back in the marital bed. Not that this means we're back on. I just don't want you to think that I'm toying with you. No. It's okay, we both wanted this. But at the risk of sounding pushy, what does this mean? I don't know. Yeah, things have just been so messy and this feels... Like home. Yeah. I've, I've been all over the place. And work was crazy and, and our relationship disasters and... Poor Jojo. Yeah. And, I mean, taking psilocybin in the middle of it all probably didn't help. Do you think? Well, all I know is, is that we, we were fine one minute and then you did that trial. We had problems before that. The things we could have worked through. I just... I'm saying that maybe you weren't yourself when you decided to call time on our marriage. I should go. You don't have to. The babysitter is waiting. <laughs> okay. No pressure. Ah, oh, fan, that's a good idea. Mm, Marty's. <laughs> Oh, I can't have you and Bubs overheating. Mm, well, the air comms getting fixed today, so that's a waste of time. You look comfy. Is that a dig? No, I am all about comfort with where I've been growing lately. Yes, well, these clothes are very old and I can't remember where they're from. OK, um, my desk beckons me. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, those two. Yeah, totes and daubs. <laughs> Sorry, Mon. Oh, is that still a problem for you? Oh, no. Esther has Marty totally whipped and is extremely unattractive. Morning. Have you got something to say? No, no. Did you see that? Hmm? What? The way he looked at me. What? Like he doesn't approve of this. Well, well I... but it is a big change. Yeah. I mean, it's just as long as you haven't, you know, given up. This is a protest. Women are held to a different standard than men, oh. valued for their appearance alone, when we have so much more to give than just our looks. Yep, yep, yep. Here, here. Yeah, it's a dirty double standard, and I'm not standing for it anymore. Yep, very clearly. <laughs> we'll see you both later. You're with me, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yes, of course. Oh, juicy calls. Yeah. Morning, uh. Morning. How are you? Good. How are you? I'm fine. I'm also fine. Thanks for asking. Uh, breakfast. Do you want your usual? Please. OK. Well, that won't be long. Yeah, um, no rush. Wait, what is going on? Nothing. Uh, things are very different between you two. You seem closer at the wake, isn't it? We have slept together. Oh! <gasps> Just... Sorry. <clears throat> um, well, that's great. Does that mean...? I, I don't know. I mean, was I just grieving? Did I want comfort? You could have found that with anyone, but you... Chose Maeve. Maeve thinks that the psilocybin might have had something to do with my decision to separate. What do you think? I don't know. I mean, it, it was so clear at the time, but now everything's a mess. Well, all I know is that I've never seen you happier than when you're with Maeve. So I think it would be a real shame for you both to throw that away. I need to do the stock take and check that the staff have the right tax codes. What? Just... Do you like my new look? What? No makeup. It's the thing I'm doing with the girls at the hospital. Liberating ourselves from male oppression and the cultural standards of beauty. OK, can we focus? Oh, you got this. I'm the silent partner, remember? If only. Oh, actually, no, I can help you with the stock take. Okay. Oh. Woman, what's she done now? <laughs> Sorry, no, that's not my place. Um, I'm just gonna order and get out of here. Maybe, yeah. What if it was your place? What are you saying? Maybe I've been too impulsive. 
Uh, I, I really have to get to this appointment, but um, can, can we put a pin in this? Are you just going to leave me hanging? Can, can we talk tonight? Yeah, here? Yeah, at the apartment. Billy's staying with Leanne. What's the date? <laughs> This is just a uh, low-stress, quick follow-up to your first session on the psilocybin trial. How I'm feeling, side effects, that sort of thing. Exactly. Well, to be honest, I feel amazing. The clarity it's given me. Uh, before, I was feeling confused and foggy, but after taking the psilocybin, I, I realised what wasn't working in my life and what I needed to change. Well, that's interesting. I, I made some tough decisions. I've, I've separated from Maeve. Oh, I didn't know. I'm sorry. It's okay. We'll figure it out. Well, that's good to hear. So I can continue on the trial? If you wish. With these results, are you kidding me? I'm, I'm hoping that they're going to help clear up my feelings for Maeve, you know, whether or not we should get back together. Sorry, that's, that's too much information. No, it's not that. Chris? Maybe you should take a break from the trial. Why? Well, we have enough other participants, and, and you have a new business, and, and your, your relationship. Are you kicking me out? Uh, not at all. What have I done wrong? <laughs> Nothing. Chris, just tell me. I'm sorry, that, that's all I can say. Uh, thanks for coming. I know, Chris, you can't just do that. I've, I've made some serious, life-changing decisions because of this trial. If there's something I should know, you just just tell me. You're aware that there's a control group as well as the trial? Yeah, of course. You gave me a placebo. Hey, how's it going? Did you know? What? That I got a placebo. Chris told you. How could you? I couldn't say anything, and Chris shouldn't have either. Well, I made him. I talked to you about it, about how much it's helping me, about the clarity that it's giving me. That kid's okay. No, it's not okay. Do you understand how foolish I feel? I never meant to make you feel that way. That clarity, it was still real. No, it was all just in my messed up head. I never got the psilocybin. But you got the counselling. <laughs> that helped, didn't it? You started listening to yourself. No. No. What you wanted. No, it's all a lie, right? Even you. Some mate. 